How's it going, everybody? Pray that it's going great for you. Uh, what I was going to talk about this morning is manifesting stuff, right? That's what the big thing is now. Everybody wants to manifest their future by, you know, envisioning things and doing it all, try to do it all through yourself and, you know, you can manifest money and whatever, you know, just, it's up. I know all of that, but after I found out what the Bible had to say about it all, God says that he does everything for us. He knows what would make us the happiest. He knows what we need more than what we know what we need. And he tells us to leave it up to him. So why in the world would I try to manifest anything for myself in this place down here? Wait. I mean, Bible says that, you know, if you gain the whole world, but you lose your soul, well, what good is that, you know? It's all about going inside yourself, and it's basically all you're doing is you're playing with demons, and... But you don't even realize it. Back when I was into that kind of stuff, I uh, was even doing a little bit of telekinesis. I mean, they tell us that, you know. But. Just thinking about that, so I thought I'd make a short little video on that this morning. So, if you want to trust in yourself, basically, go ahead and trust in yourself, you know. But, I'm just going to go ahead and trust in the Lord. Trust in Jesus. It says that the kingdom of heaven is inside of us. He is inside of us. So he can give us anything that we need as far as health goes, as far as anything, if you trust in him. That's like when you think when you're sun gazing, you know, all these benefits that you get from it, right? You know, it says, oh, it can fix your eyes and get better vision, you know, just all kinds of different stuff health benefit wise you know except then you are putting you your trust in most likely what you're looking at the sun simulator anyways so you're putting your trust in the sun simulator instead of putting your trust in Jesus we have his spirit that lives inside of us when you're born again he gives you his Holy Spirit that lives inside of us go to him for your health don't go to the other don't put your faith and your trust in this sick system you know Jesus says that he he does it all he fixes us, tells us not to call anybody on earth a doctor or a father or a master or a rabbi. Go to him. You don't have to worry about manifesting anything. Trust in Jesus. And he'll man, as you're living in the repeat, he will put in front of you what he wants to put in front of you. And besides, you're supposed to really just be happy 
for in Jesus is the only thing anyway. So what are you going to manifest in your life to try to make you happy here? What do you want a big boat or something or you want to be a millionaire? I don't know. I would much rather have Jesus. So if you do what the Bible says, you love Jesus, you, you know, you love God with all your heart, mind, and soul, and you love your neighbor as yourself, and you love your enemies, well then, you would just automatically be resonating at a high vibration, wouldn't you? If you just do what the Bible says, what God tells us to do, you'd be all set. All right, long enough, longer than I thought it was going to be. So, uh, you know, one thing I did see the other day that I was going to tell everybody about. Now, you ever see these, uh, they look like a chemtrail plane, kind of, but they look really small, like they're supposed to look like they're up there like so high, and they only have like one white streak coming out of the back of them. And I've seen them before, and I just thought that they were like really high-flying jets. But the clouds were pretty low the other day, and one of these things was flying by, and it went under the clouds, and the clouds were pretty low. So it was either, it was something small, like it was either a drone or a shape-shifting demon. <laughs> I mean, so I'm just going to ask if any of you guys have seen those little ones like that that look like they're really high up, but they're not. They're really low. So I will talk to you guys later and pray that you have a awesome, blessed day. And that's it. See you. Love you. Bye.